Hi, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will show you how to design a simple but beautiful lower third in Photoshop. Alright, so if you're ready, let's dive right into the video. Alright, so here we are in Photoshop. Alright, so you start by creating a new document. Alright, so okay, so you go to File, New, and then it brings you to this interface. Okay, so you change, you start by giving your project in a title. Okay, I can say lower third. Alright, now the dimension I can, I wish to make it um, 1920 by 1080 because that is the standard definition um, dimension for most videos. So you change it to pixels, alright, pixels. Then your width is um, 1920. Your height is 1080. All right. Okay. Pixels per inch. You can leave it at 72 since we are not going to be printing this um, this design. All right. So you click create. All right. So here we are. A black, our blank canvas. Sorry. Okay. So now the next step is to you can um, use a blank canvas or you can choose to import or insert an image. But I think I like an image so. I go to file let me insert an image into our, our background I don't like it plain so okay, I think I like this um, red all right so you just drag it to make it bigger all right okay that's that's a good one okay so let's begin the design process proper so you insert a rectangle all right so you come to your where you have your shape, your tool um, icons here by the left hand side, you navigate to where you have your shapes. All right, I want a rectangle. Okay, okay, it should go across the screen. Rectangle. All right. Okay, I think um, change. I can. I wish to change it, the color to white. So I come to here on your properties bar here or where you have your um, your layers here, you can either change the color from here or your properties bar. I think I prefer the properties bar. So I click here and then change the color to white. All right, this is white. All right, I can also increase the size of this one, make it a little bit bigger. Okay, make it bigger a bit more. All right, so then. I can duplicate, so I can just say rectangle, just rename it so that you can easily identify when you are designing. So I can say rectangle one. Okay, so I can duplicate this layer. All right, duplicate and make it, I can rename it as rectangle two. All right, so, and then you drag it down. All right, just take it a little bit inside this one. So I can change the color of this one to, um, okay, let's see. Let me change it to something a, li a little bit darker. Okay, maybe a blue, it's a blue color. All right. So, all right, so now, all right. So we have successfully created our rectangle now the next thing i you, you go ahead and insert because i would like to um insert an image of maybe the pastor preaching or the person that is making the presentation all right so i think maybe i should reduce the size of this a bit let me reduce the size of the rectangles a bit okay i think this is this is okay all right so i think this is okay then i can now insert um a circle on my lower third because I like to display the image of the maybe uh, a pastor preaching or the, the 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 person making the presentation. Okay, so I come to shapes and then ellipse tool. All right, so I hold my shift key so as to have a, a an even uh, drawing or an, a, a balanced shape. All right. Okay. The next step is to locate the image I want to use for okay maybe the name of the pastor or the, the the person making the presentation right so i go to file 
and then um, place embed okay fire place embed I locate the image I would like to use as um, the person making the presentation okay, I think I like this one all right so so I, I this is the image so I can change it to image all right then I drag the image and place over the ellipse tool or over the ellipse rather and then I click right click and select insert or oh, sorry I, I click clip create clipping mask all right good so all right so I can now rename okay so we have successfully okay inserted our image into the shape in our lower third so I can now put um, the name of the pastor above here or the person making the presentation okay so I can say so I come to my text tool all right and click okay okay we wait for that to load up all right so I can say okay I can say pastor pastor Franklin Marin, all right. This is just a fictitious name, okay, just for the design project. So I can, okay, okay. Let me change the color to something else so that it doesn't clash with the background. So I can change this color to um, maybe a black, okay, maybe a black. All right, okay. Pastor Franklin Marin. All right then beneath it i can put his designation maybe the senior pastor so i just come and duplicate this text all right so i can say designation okay so i can say um senior pastor okay i can say um senior pastor Mount Manville Ministries. All right. So I can uh, let me use a, a let me change the font. Let me change the font to a okay. Change the font here to something okay. Let me change the font to something smaller or lighter. Okay. To, this is cool all right so senior pastor manville ministries okay of course i can reduce the size of the text okay then of course i can also change the color of the text all right so i can change the color to white okay so all right so this is our lower third we have successfully designed a very beautiful lower third in photoshop all right and you can use this um design in your vmix okay your youtube videos your um obs or whatever video editing or live streaming software all right so i'm sure you had value from this video please give the video a like share and also subscribe to my channel so all right so till i see you in my next video take care and stay safe